It looks like it's been so severely damaged that even its head was dented in. That'd be the fatal wound, right? Sorry. The same wire is tied to his arms. It's almost like he was bound up or something. Oh, Kincaid. You know what? I didn't even notice that. Yeah, he is tied up. What's up with that? Yeah, dude. Maybe the killer pressed this button and made Nekamaro enter sleep mode. Well, the hammer on the floor, the chain wrapped around the door at the far back, and the wire that tied up Nekamaru. All the evidence at this crime scene consists of things we've never seen inside this building, doesn't it? Uh, so that's why you mentioned the final dead room. Mm -hmm. See, just pick up the receiver and press the strawberry button, right? Damn right. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like someone broke the damn elevator. It's not moving at all. And we can't enter the tower from Strawberry Hall because the door button there is broken too. Nagito, I'm talking to you. Yeah. We get Are to we? play as yeah. Nagito. <laughs> My dream! Oh, it's come no. true! No! <clears throat> I'm the main character now, bitches! Yay! Huh? Don't ham me! I figured you weren't even listening. Oh, I was just thinking about being in the brain of Hajime. <laughs> Sorry, I was just thinking. <laughs> you were probably thinking of something messed up, weren't you? But I have been listening to you. Nakamura was killed, right? Then that Damn body right. discovery announcement was referring to him. Damn it. <laughs> Out of everyone here, it just had to be Nakamaru. Damn it! After what he went through to come back to us. Damn it! How pitiful. It's tantamount to being killed twice, truly. He was a man burdened by terrible misfortune. Hey! Okay, so now that we... Hey, uh, Kazuichi, you're nowhere near the fucking elevator, fixing I noticed. Fixing the elevator! Hoop de doo on the second floor, fixing the elevator. <laughs> okay, so now that we know the situation over there, is it all right if I go ahead and fix the elevator? Oh, now you're doing it. Cool. We've all been awake uh, for two hours. Is it all right if you wait a little bit? Before you do that, we should... Did you call for me? Get the Monokuma file, right? <gasps> Oh, he's here! Now then. It seems you guys have noticed that the incident has taken place. So this is for you. Red bean bread and milk. And there's a bonus item. It's the Monokuma file. What do you say? Do your best. <laughs> Come on, satisfy your hunger with this. The Monokuma file. And do your very best on the investigation. <laughs> Halfway through it. Oh, God. Right. Is the Monokuma file being treated like a bonus item? <sighs> Whatever, man. Let's just eat. Eating should come first right now. Damn right. Yep, you're right. It's okay if you guys eat, but can you hear me out while you're at it? What do you yearn for? Ask the line. <laughs> Well, I was thinking about what we should do, and I wanted to discuss it. Even so. Thanks to the killer, we can't even go to the crime scene. We have to wait till Kazuichi fixes the elevator. True. There's no doubt that the killer is responsible. But it seems as though they made a huge mistake. There's no way the Symbols of Hope will give up because of this little setback. There's no way everyone will just cross their arms and wait for the class trial to start. We need to do everything we can on our end to prepare for the class trial, right? Well, yeah. Fine. It seems that we too shall begin the investigation on our end, though it remains unclear how much we can do. <laughs> Is this acceptable? If I show my serious side, things will not end with mere child's play. Uh, I'm so glad. I knew you guys were pumped up from the start. How beautiful. Uh huh. Even though you guys are suffering from despair, I can see that you guys are still fighting for hope. Ah, uh, such beauty! Uh-huh. There's no higher honor for me than to investigate this murder with you guys. Uh-huh. So we need to be grateful towards Nekamaru for becoming the foundation of this hope. Wrap it up. Well, regardless. Uh-huh. Now, I got a lot of things to think about, okay? <laughs> Whose side should I be on for this case? The killer? Mm, 
for the rest of you guys. Hmm. I must make sure I face this case's mystery properly if I'm gonna find out which side is the true hope. <laughs> I'm sane. Hey, you guys, why don't you try arranging the sequence of events in this case? Uh, actually, know, so how about Kazuichi, you fix the elevator and you two, we can talk. I'm good over here. So we can properly understand the situation we're in. Fine. <laughs> Was that your Kazuichi? <laughs> yeah. I'm good over here. <laughs> I'm, I have, I'm good over here. I have no objections. Proceed. Then let's look back at what happened this morning. We tried to use the elevator so we could participate in Monokuma Tai Chi, right? Damn right. Since we're staying at Strawberry House in order for us to get to the meeting spot at Grape Tower, we needed to use the elevator first and go to Grape House. That was before 7 a.m., since it was right before Monokuma Tai Chi. Man. But once we realized the elevator was... <clears throat> but once we realized the elevator was disabled, I seriously panicked. Anyway. I was like, oh no, the, the elevator's broken. <laughs> and since we couldn't fu do anything about it, we just tried to get inside the tower from Strawberry Hall. But when we actually got there, the button on the hall door was broken. Thanks to that, we couldn't enter the tower at all. <laughs> Funny that. <laughs> yeah, so Fuhika suggested that we use the phone and call Grape House. <laughs> and I hadn't this broken the phone yet, so we wait. I... Of causality. And that was everything that happened this morning. Also, I fed my hamsters. Is that relevant? <laughs> I must say, I'm surprised. I never expected that the elevator would be disabled. But then, how was Nekamaru able to go to Grape Tower? Man. Well, obviously, he went before the elevator was disabled. And then, and when was that? You... Idiot, if we knew that, this wouldn't be difficult. Well... No, we might know what time he went to Grape Tower. You serious? Huh? Seriously? I... It... <laughs> I like that sound bite. I... <laughs> it was around sunrise. That's when I saw him going down to the first floor. What would you quantify as sunrise? What? There are no windows. You you mean you personally witnessed Nekomaru going to Grape Tower? Hey, hey! When was this sunrise? Was it before the rumbling sound? Huh? Rumbling sound? Oh, huh? that was my tummy, huh? What? Uh. You don't remember? Right after the clock in the lounge started ringing, we heard a rumbling noise. What? Did that clock even ring in the first place? Hey, hey, hey! Wait, ring? The ring it ha We've established the ring is not an alarm, it's a telephone, so someone tried to call? Mm. You didn't notice that either? Seriously, that thing was super loud! That's weird. Hmm, I feel like we're not quite on the same wavelength. Well, it is what it is. There's no way you guys will ever be on the same wa wavelength as trash like me. Uh-huh. <laughs> Looks like this is leading to an interesting development. <laughs> That's a funny noise. <laughs> it's, it's hard to fucking laugh when I'm already squeezing my torso. Hmm. Oh. Speak Academy founder Izuru Kamakura. I understand why the school sh would immortalize such an important person in a portrait. That was a lot of peas. Mm -hmm. But why would they put it in a place like this? What are they trying to show me? Guys, so... don't look at that. Don't look at that, guys. Don't, don't, <laughs> don't look don't at Don't look at that. Don't, don't worry about it. Let's <laughs> guess that he knows who that is. And he's like, why is that here? That's a good point. Just as I thought, this telephone is connected to Grape House. And why is there a portrait of my grandpa over there? <laughs> if a means of communication was prepared, it's as if something like this was expected to happen. Well, I'm probably overthinking things. <laughs> Typical nuggets. This is the clock everyone's been talking about, right? Mm, Are you know. the famous clock? <laughs> hey, can I get your autograph? I never knew tick, this clock had tock, an alarm function. Tick, 
TikTok. Tick. Oh, that's my favorite app. <laughs> Shut this alarm up. is set to 5:30 a.m. That probably means something. What do you think, Kazuuchi? I don't think. I build. Are you Ke <laughs> Kazuichi? Hey, Kazuichi! <laughs> you don't mind? Can you can you inform me? That stuff about rumbling noise and the ringing clock. What was that all about? You, Every uh, night I go to sleep, I put earbuds in. Every day I wake up, boom. <laughs> Seriously, you don't know? No! God, we've established this. Just tell me. Every time I fall asleep, I'm screaming the entire night. <laughs> You're so kind, Kazuichi. Thank you for actually taking the time to explain it to me. I didn't say that. Huh? <laughs> <sighs> so, that's how it is. Fine, I'll tell you. Whoa. It happened last night. Kazuichi vision. Now, this Kazuichi's is what it looks like when he pulls his beanie over his head. This is what's happening inside his mind all the time. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was sleeping peacefully in my room when all of a sudden I heard this huge sound. Ah! Ah! Oh, what the hell? The sound was super loud, so I rushed out of my room. And as I went down the hall toward the lounge. Hey! What are this you is doing? A lovely image. This oh was... my god! It's louder than the supreme ruler of the netherworld bellowing mm -hmm. for a sacrifice. Don't go making all that noise so suddenly. What is with this it's picture? Not me. I don't know. This was definitely drawn by a different artist. This is Whoa, like. just started ringing. I was just trying to stop it. This Hurry looks up and stop like it, already. it was outsourced so to someone else. <laughs> I, I know. I'm in the middle of doing that. I really wish these cutscenes were done by the person who does the uh, the manga drawings. Mm. Or person of the yeah, studio so, group. They're so lovely. Yeah. That's when the sound ah. finally stopped. Man, that totally freaked me out. Well, I'm definitely wide awake now. What did you do I to me? I fucking Gundam sleeps in his entire get up. <laughs> I know, with his like giant JoJo's Bizarre Adventure <laughs> collar. <laughs> Why my must I have so many trinkets? It's like there's ten peas under my mattress. <laughs> my mental defenses were bombarded with sonic resonance. You! Fuyuhiko! Was this not your doing just now? Shut up! W why would anyone do something so childish? I know I look like a little baby <gasps> man. <laughs> you must have rushed over after hearing that sound. But you sure seem to get there pretty fast. Well, yeah. Well, I didn't rush over here. I was at the lounge by coincidence. You fiend. Coincidence. Mm -hmm. Huh? What, what? Do you doubt me? Hey. Whatever. I don't really give a crap, but it's 5.30 a.m. Aw, man. Man, thanks to Fuyuhiko, I woke up early for no reason. I should go back to sleep. <laughs> and then, and then that Kazuichi the sound of took Kazuichi. a big <laughs> fart before he left. <laughs> the fucking vine boom sound. And then Kazuichi hit fucking Fuyuhiko in the head so hard. And it resonated throughout the entire building. <laughs> huh? What was that sound? What's going on? Earthquake! This pressure. <laughs> it did not That's feel annoying. like it shook. Hey, 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 There's no way this building is gonna collapse, right? So, Kazuichi was here when the kabloom happened. If this is a true and story, this is coming. This is Fuyuhiko and Gundam's uh, account, as well as Kazuichi's right now. Kazuichi's telling the story, but these two are at the scene. So, right. they so would. So, Kazuichi, I mean, all of this, him being in his room and getting up at this time would have to be true. Because um, okay. Fuyuhiko and Gundam saw it too. I mean, good, because I don't want Kazuichi to be the killer because it's too yeah. obvious. Yeah, it's very obvious, and I also like the big idiot boy. Mm -hmm. hey. Oh, wait, sorry. This is the way the building is going to collapse. Hey, Kazuichi, stop clinging to me. Hold me, Fuyuhiko! Mm. I am scared! And that's what happened. 
<laughs> uh, Kazuichi included the part where he clung to Fuyuhiko like a child. <laughs> yeah, and then I tried to hug Fuyuhiko, but since he's a fucking sundere, he wouldn't accept my love. I tried sticking my hands inside of his mm. pockets out of out of comfort, but he didn't. He wouldn't let me. I know the feeling, dude. I see. So you're the one who was clinging to Fuyuhiko. That's obviously wrong. That's, that's not the important part. Why did you include it? <laughs> it is in my mind. What happened afterward? Did you ever let him go? Hey. We decided to wait things out, but in the end, nothing else happened. <laughs> also, <laughs> yeah, we just Kazuichi hugged. We didn't wouldn't do let anything me else. let him down until if he felt safe. He just <laughs> got fucking Kazuichi in the uh, a wedding carry, and <laughs> so it's okay. Or like a Scooby Doo hold. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> and not just that. We all felt really weak, so we decided to just go back to our rooms for a while. Hmm, I see. Yep, what you said just now was extremely important. Thanks to that, I thought of one suspicious person. What? Me! Who are you talking about? Me, of <laughs> course! Huh? <laughs> huh? I love being in the mind of this guy. I mean, isn't it strange? I was the only one who didn't notice an alarm that was so loud, everyone else came out of their rooms. Well, the same goes for the rumbling noise that you guys heard after that. Why, you... Hey, you better not try to confuse the shit out of us. Of course I'm not. For now... God hey, damn hey, it! Hey. That mm -hmm. for now line is what's making us even more worried! Anyway, it seems there's no <laughs> doubt that what you guys just told me is a very important clue. <laughs> They're all like like staring bullets at him and he just turns around and goes, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> and then he starts thinking, you know, in his head stuff that he would say out loud. <laughs> the wall clock alarm you heard first and the rumbling noise that came right after. Now then, how do these noises relate to this case? That's a good point. This one's got me a little stumped. Yeah, this, uh, this is a bit of a tinker. Yeah, hey, you said that you witnessed Negamaro at sunrise, right? Can you explain that to me in more detail? I... Were you drinking tea in the lounge with your legs crossed all daintily? I was so oh, wait, hungry yesterday no that I couldn't sleep. I figured it was nearly morning, so I went to go check the clock in the lounge. It turns out it was totally off. It was still around 5 a.m. Hey. And that's when it happened. I heard the sound of the door closing off in the distance. When I stuck my head out from the lounge, <laughs> I saw a he bear so wandering down the <laughs> stairs. <laughs> I saw Nekomaru's back. I saw back. him and I was like, damn, he looking fine. Damn, man, how many squats you do, you know what I mean? By the <laughs> way, I just realized what his stupid hair is. Yeah, looking from oh. the back, it's plain as day. <laughs> that is an awful cut. That, saw, that is terrible, dude. I saw Nekamaru's back. He was about to go downstairs to the first floor. I thought about running after him, but I didn't have the energy or willpower to do it. No, wait, come back. No, stop, please. If I knew something like this would happen, I would have mustered the strength to follow him. He was probably going to take a shit. Yeah. Hey, hey! But why would Nekomaru wander off so early in the morning to take a I... shit? Mm -hmm. I was wondering about that too. I mean, I already knew I wasn't going to be able to sleep. So I just sat in the lounge, staring off into space for no real reason, and waited for him to come back. Jeez. And that's when the clock in the lounge started ringing. Thanks to that loud alarm, I completely forgot about Nekomaru. Until just now. Then, from the time you saw Nekomaru until the alarm rang, you were at the lounge the whole time? I sort of zone out for a second thinking about a different way this chapter could have gone that might have been interesting from a character perspective of Nekomaru. Um, if he just opted to go into sleep mode for this entire thing until somebody died, and then he's like, oh, everything that you guys experienced was just a blink. And now I'm awake. And we need to go take care of this murder thing. 
Uh huh. Uh, interesting. I do wonder how the sleep mode is going to factor into this case at all. Yeah. Yeah. My only assumption is it was used to disable him so that they could tie him up and then yeah, fork him on the head. Yeah, wrap wire around him maybe as a, as a red herring. Yeah. I don't know. But what were you doing during that time? By chance, were you thinking about everything that's happened so far and getting... Choked up. What? I'm sorry. Is is Nagito just Ammer? <laughs> <laughs> hey, I, I said he was drinking tea. <laughs> but yes, this is true. Were you Mom, getting emotional? Was I right? Did you have little you... tears in your eyes? No, of, of course not. You're, you're completely wrong. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're absolutely right. And I thought you were reminiscing about Pekko or something, but that can't be right. After all, you already know how pointless it is to cling to memories of the dead. Pretty cool, dude. <laughs> Pretty cool! That's me! What do you think, Gundam? Never mind, I don't care. I get it now. Thanks <laughs> to everyone's detailed information, I'm slowly getting a grasp of the situation! He, you, literally, you can't talk to Gundam! <laughs> if I put events in chronological order minus Gundam, Fuyuhiko witnesses Nekamaru at 5 a.m. That's the time Nekamaru apparently went down to the first floor. At 5.30 a.m., the alarm clock in the lounge started ringing. When that happened, you two woke up and left your rooms to go to the lounge where Fuyuhiko was. <laughs> right after that, you heard a strange rumbling sound that didn't quite make sense. Let's make history. Now that I think about it, something might have happened to Nekumaru before that noise. Oh, daring. If so, that must have been Nekomaru's final re before he breathed his last robo breath. Hmm. Hold on. If Nekomaru died when we heard that sound, doesn't that mean we have an alibi? Alibi? Well, us three I mean... do. <laughs> when we heard I that rumbling noise, we were at the me. lounge, you know? Gundam was looking, you know, normal. <laughs> His head definitely wasn't too big, and he definitely isn't a character from the Adams Family values. His arms aren't crossed, like, really strangely, and the posing <laughs> is kind of awkward. <laughs> My hand is, like, kind of disappearing in this shot. Like, you can just extend the arm out further to help the pose. Anyway, if that's when the killer murdered Nekomaru, then we have a solid alibi. I was tangenting. Tangenting! Dad, why? Get it? <laughs> Can't argue with that tangent. <laughs> hmm, it might be too soon to declare that just yet, but we can't be certain unless we first clear up the mystery surrounding that rumbly noise. Ooh, that rumbly. Hmm, a rumbly noise, huh? Did hmm. something heavy fall over or something? Also, based on what everyone just told me, there's another thing I'm curious about. You all heard that alarm clock in the lounge go off just before the rumble. What does, what do you suppose that means, hey. Hand? Hey, haven't we talked enough? I really think I should repair the elevator soon. I'm surprised that I'm not talking while you're doing this. Oh my, you're still here? Dad? <sighs> Once the elevator's fixed, I'm gonna let you, any, I'm not gonna let you anywhere near it. And so Kazuichi ran down the stairs, complaining for some reason. Jeez. So what should we do now? Uh, there's something I wanted to wanted you to do, and something I wanted to do to you. After the elevator is fixed, there's something I want you to investigate. Huh? What is it? Go into the final dead room and die. The clock's in the first floor lounge of both Grape House and Strawberry House. Right after that, you heard a strange rumbling sound that didn't quite make sense. Huh? huh? Why? I'll tell you later. Hey, bastard. Fine. But why are you asking me? You can investigate that yourself. I would investigate it myself, but by the time the elevator is fixed, there's a chance I might not be with you all anymore. Uh -huh. There's a chance I won't be in this world anymore. Huh? I mean, he would be able to do the final dead room just fine, because he's got luck. That's true. Anyway, I'm counting on you. <laughs> That bastard doesn't make any sense. Sorry, I was just thinking, did, was he implying he was going to, like, leave? Like, the group? Uh, like, all of us, or...? Well, he can't at the moment. Yeah. The quickest way to escape is dying. Yeah. Now then, uh, here comes the main event! 
There's only one thing I can do for them. I can go to that place for everyone's sake. I can't let them face that danger. I must be the pariah who goes in their place. Here I go! Oh, I'm oh. a walking, talking martyr, yay! That's it, I should investigate one more time before I head over there. All the information that's in my brain will be useless once I die. <laughs> the elevator and the door at the far back of Strawberry Hall. Just in case, it might be good to check and make sure they're really blocked off. Okay, step, the elevator step, step, and step, the step, door. Step, step. If I can go chuka chuka chuka, Hello, and then it's it kind of opens me. a little bit, <laughs> then it's oh, never mind. They were nope. They were they were not yep. lying. That is broken okay. as hell. That's pretty broke. It's the strawberry hall door that leads to the tower. The button is broken. There's no way it'll open. As I recall, based on what Fuyuhiko told Hajime over the phone, he was like, damn right. And the <laughs> other side of this door is also barred with chains. Whoops. They must have been really cautious to go to the trouble of barring the door from both sides. Something about that seems a little suspicious. Let's make history. Hello. Hello, I'm here too. <laughs> the killer's intent. I can think of only one explanation. Oh, Gundam. <laughs> Perhaps. I'm sure that was the inflection they were from... hoping for. <laughs> Perhaps they intended to keep me from entering the scene of the crime. Listen well. Which means the killer was afraid. Afraid of the conclusion promised, pro yeah, promised by yep. my assumptions. <laughs> yeah, that was probably it. I came over here to collect the truth bullets, nothing more. My truth gun is empty, Hajime. I gotta mm. fill it up. <laughs> if I press the button next to the elevator, the door should open so I can ride it. But nothing happens when I press it. <gasps> Looks like it's definitely broken. Huh? Hey, what are you doing? You're getting in the way of my repairs. Stop. Hey, why did the elevator break in the first place? And Stop. <laughs> oh, the killer malfunctioned the safety device. Look, you see that silver cover under the button? It looks like that's the elevator control panel. They probably opened it up and messed with the settings. But the cover is locked, so they wouldn't have to be able to open it unless they have some kind of tool. Hmm? Are there any tools in this building? Only uh, you. Yeah. No, there shouldn't be, except you. I don't really know <gasps> if they forced it open with a tool anyway. I'm not that thin. I am pretty thin, though. The control panel on this side wasn't the one that was forced open. Hmm, I see. It's the control panel on the Grape House's side that's broken then. Yeah. Uh, if the one on this side isn't broken, that's the only thing I can think of. I'm pretty sure there should be a control panel over there too. Plus the elevator is stuck on the Grape House side. Wouldn't that mean? The last person who used this elevator went to Grape House? Uh, yep, it's official. The elevator was disabled on the other side. Hey! Hey, I don't have time to talk to you. Hurry up and go away! You... Jeez, I'm trying to do repairs without any tools. No matter how much time I get, it won't be enough. If you don't have any tools, why don't you use this? Huh? Me! What the fuck? What? <laughs> huh? Whoa. I should. I'm fucking. You ever seen Squid Game? You know how that lady smuggled those cigarettes in? That's what I did. I've never seen that show, and now I never will because um, you spoiled it. <laughs> <laughs> is is this a multi tool? Where'd you get something like this? I had it with me before I even arrived at the fourth island. If we're going to explore a new island, it's essential to be able to stab whoever you need to at any moment. There's a knife and on this, Nagito! Kind of you what serious? It, there's blood on it too, this... and it's fresh. <laughs> Guys, okay, this this is a butter knife. I kind of expected there to be toast here. <laughs> and I'm very disappointed. A guy like you has been walking around with a dangerous tool this whole time. So I just got distracted. It would be pretty funny to see Kazuichi with his 
his zipper all the way up, it would like be going over his face <laughs> like on him. That's true. That's that's true. Is there something wrong? I'm just thinking about your zipper, uh, dude. Everyone thinks about my zipper. Just get it out of the mm. way. It's it's nothing. All right, come here. Hold still. No, I didn't mean it. I meant in your head. Then I'll let you have this. Your repairs might go faster now, right? But in exchange, a kiss. I want you to do something. Huh? Remember the chicken me. dance. This multi-tool has a compass. It points to me at all times. No! After the elevator is fixed, I want you to ride the elevator and see how the compass reacts. What, what the hell for? Well, to be honest, there's something I still don't understand regarding the structure of this building. Ah, here it comes. So please, I really need this information to find out the relationship between the building and the elevator. Huh? I don't really get it, but, well, as long as I'm just checking a compass, I don't mind. I'm glad. Then I'll leave the rest to you. Elevator! Just as I thought, there's no mistaking it. This is an elevator. Mm -hmm. And it goes to Strawberry Hall door. Look like they're completely broken. I didn't manage to bridge that <laughs> sentence as well as I hoped. <laughs> the elevator and the Strawberry Hall <clears throat> door are broke. I didn't expect the contact elevator to be disabled from Grape House. Uh huh. As long as it's disabled, there's no way to move between houses. Which means the person who disabled the elevator would be stuck at Grape House. Nice! <laughs> that person, they should still be at Grape House, but... No, it's too soon to form an answer. But I won't be too late to find the answer, even after I finish investigating. That room... Ooh. And I know which one it is! Ooh. It's, this baby. it's the big strawberry secret room! The final dead room! Let me add it! Give me, give me, Only give me, give me. Those who win the life threatening game contained within will reach the octagon! And inside the octagon? Presents! And the ultimate weapon! There's no doubt Nekomaru's killer has to. has been to that place! No matter where I search, there's no weapons anywhere in this building. Question. Do you think it's Chiaki? She's not at the table. She, like, as soon as you left, she went right in. Yeah. <laughs> no, you guys went back together. I think it's implied that, like, if Chiaki told you, no, don't go in, it, it implies she already went in and got the weapon. Hmm. Regardless, well, it'd be pretty hard to find uh, to hide um, a fucking uh, <laughs> a giant hammer. <laughs> well, I think we're about to find out if we're Regardless about to go in. Regardless of the weapon used to kill Nekomaru, the killer must have obtained it in there. If that's the case, I should get going. Also, unlike everyone else, I don't mind dying at all, so that's all the more reason why I should go. Oh, I'm getting excited. What's inside? What's inside? What's inside? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, great! There's fucking puzzles in here. No! So this <laughs> is the final dead room. Feels a little eerie. I hope I don't get scared. <laughs> ah! Clack! Did the door just lock? <clears throat> I see the door designed to automatically lock. It's not. It's not I would have turned back if I stayed oh my on the. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this translation is great. Oh, fuck me. Do you want... You know what? If Wait, Monami... do you want to take Monami? Yeah. Uh, uh... Go for it. Whoa! And I thought the final door... I thought the door finally opened. Now it's locked again. Oh, she's been stuck in here the whole time. I figure you'd turn up since I haven't seen you in a while. And I never expected to see you here. <laughs> Nagito? Huh? Wait, no, that's still you. <laughs> huh? Why are you in such a dangerous place? Same to you. Why are you here? I... Just to suffer? Ah, I heard the body discovery announcement and I thought something happened in this room. And you got locked in when you came inside. You're a fool from head to toe. <laughs> H2T. I, I am truly ashamed. Well, not that I care. 
Just make sure you don't get in my way. Um, Everyone hates her. Get mm -hmm. in your way! The life-threatening game is gonna start soon, right? It'd be annoying if you got in my way. Could it be? Are, are, are you planning to do, 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 do it? Well, if I don't, I can't get out of here, right? And besides, the only way trash like me can be useful is by risking my life for everyone's sake. That's wrong! You're wrong! Nagito is not trash at all! Uh, no comprende? <laughs> There's no such thing as a human being who doesn't deserve to live! <laughs> I know I'm being heartwarming right now, but my heart is super scared and pounding like crazy! Are you sure you're not just excited? You know, isn't it exciting to think that I can finally be useful for the sake of those who shoulder hope? Now then... <laughs> about this so-called life-threatening game... Hmm... I'm Fuck. still here! Alrighty! Nagito, is there anything you don't get? Just ask me! If there's anything you don't mm -hmm. get, just ask me! By all means, I'll help you and make sure you get out of here! Leave it to me! Bring it on, escape game! That sounds like something a teacher would say, but I wouldn't expect too much from her. Up, oh, up. Oh. Okay, all right. I'm gonna need your help for this one. Uh huh. Let me. I'm gonna. I'm gonna use the mouse for this one since it's like a old school yeah. point and click. Look at that. There's something written in blood on the wall. <sighs> looks like it's the number three. These blood symbols alone don't make sense, but maybe if I combine them with something else? Like a dadis? Like a daddy? Okay. This must be the unlocking device for the iron bars. I probably have to put in the four no digit problem. passcode. I have a secret plan. If you input 9,999 combinations, it'll eventually open. Well, I should be able to get it right first try just by guessing. You're right, but there doesn't seem to be any buttons for inputting a password. Yeah. Oh! It looks like there might be under this lid, but it doesn't seem to open. Not just that, what's this red light that's on top of this device? Okay. Is it doing like a weird like Morse code thing or something? Yeah. Let Hang on, let's let's look at that Three, pattern real quick. One, two, hmm. Mm. Three, one, mm. two, two. I'm sure that informs something. Hello, six. There's something written on blood in the um. wall. It's the number six. These blood symbols alone to me. Okay, yep. TV? This television looks broken. Okay, cool. Six, seven, three. Uh, blissfully three. brief explanations. We love it. Drawers. Ah, oh, lit. Pliers, huh? This might be useful for something, so I should grab it. This might be useful for pulling okay. out my own teeth. <laughs> I bet that would make everyone so happy. <laughs> I'd be silly gum man. Smoosh. <laughs> Smooth. Hmm. This looks like some <laughs> kind of password. The first letters of the days of the week are probably the password. What? I doubt it's that simple, because it goes Sunday, Monday, ba 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 Saturday. But it's missing... Whoops. It would be missing a day then, I believe. I, I didn't realize they were days of the week. Well, that's Monami's theory. It's locked. It won't open. God, that's not scary at all. Hello. It's Monokuma plushie. Definitely doesn't look Hello. like a cardboard you cutout. You punish you guys? Ah! Okay. It looks like this plushie talks when you squeeze the tummy! Thrills! Chills! Kills! Life-size Monokuma! Now for the special price of only $10,000! <laughs> An advertisement? Oh, that's it. Ooh, there's something shining under the bed! I like shinies! Gimme, gimme! Shiny, shiny! Oh, I can't reach it! Looks like the bed is fixed to the floor. I can't even move it. Is there something thin and long? Oh, it's my peanut. Peanut. Watch the news. Watch the news. Oh. What? <laughs> it might get cursed. I might get cursed just by looking at it. 
<laughs> it's just a secret code. Plus, it's pretty. It's a pretty common one. Eh? Secret code? Nagito, do you happen to know what this means? Yeah, it's a common riddle. Oh, I'm not gonna tell you though. Get fucked. North, east, west, okay. south. Okay. I assume. Oh. Whoops. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. Ah, a hanger. We will use Five. that to get the shiny thing. Give me. I show. This hanger hanging in the closet. Oh, oh, oh wait, wait, wait. I, I think I got it already. If we're looking for yeah. north, east, west, south, each side of the wall, we just need to determine where north is. Okay. And then we do it, it might in be order. Useful for something, so I should grab it just in case. Obtained hanger. Maybe if okay, I get so a nice get stylish thing. jacket, I can hang it up and not wear it. Something shining. Can't mm. reach it. Mm. Use a Something coat hanger. Here. Oh. Wow, I gotta do it. It's like a male video game. Oh. Whenever it's straight out, it becomes a thin stick. <laughs> That's why that sounds like a take night video game. Okay. It's made of wire. How do, oh, how pliers do, on how wire. Do you pliers on wire. Oh! They force open the iron bars. Uh. How do you uh -huh. combine shit? Oh, for goodness. Mm. Oh! Oh, so good. Yeah. So much time in. Spence for four. Is it something okay, thin well, and long? Hold on. Uh, can you use the pliers on the? Use yes. pliers on the hanger. Okay. Yay. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're motoring. We're motoring. <laughs> now we're doing it. Now we're doing it. key. Awesome. Ooh. Maybe we can escape with this Nagito. Who knows? Certainly not okay. I. Oh wait, hold on. I. The magic key. Right Scissors! Ah, now I can finally cut my hair! <laughs> ah, scissors! If you use these to cut the iron bars! What? You're joking, right? Or is that supposed to be an indirect I'm hint? I'm sorry! I'm sorry! <laughs> I'm so fucking sorry! Alright, so. Um, a computer over there. But, um. Computer? That's a way of. Uh, we can assume that north is maybe this. I wouldn't assume so, is the thing, because it's like... Yeah, but we can try it either... Hmm, I mean, there's four possible combinations if we're going um, left to right. But let's try it seven, It'd be five, five, three, six. So if we're doing news, then it's seven... It's Oops. seven, five, six, three. All righty. Yeah. Let's try so. the nine, nine, nine combinations. <laughs> I'll leave that mindless work to you, Monami. me. Ah, I'll decide as well. I'll decline as well. The password to open this. I have a feeling that the hint is close by. Okay, so. Seven. Uh, how does one make you go uppy? <laughs> oh. How oh, do okay, I combination? Out. So seven. Um, and then we went right, so it would be five, and then three and six. No, 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 no. News. New, uh, the way that it was spelt, the W and the S are flipped. So you'd want to do northeast, west, and then south. And three would be south in that so case. North so three, east. three is the last one, six is the second to last. Okay. I will trust you. Ah, don't, never trust me. It's okay, I'm putting it wrong. All right, let me try my way. All right. Um, five. Leave it to me. If you what? don't know something, don't overdo yourself. Feel free to ask me any time. I did. You I don't did need nothing. I don't need your help. So I need your help. Any Shut way up. to tell <laughs> which way? We need to know where north is. Go to computer. Um, yeah, let's look at the the pewter. Ah, oh, it's a laptop. Looks like it's on, but it's locked, so I can't really access it. So many passwords. It doesn't look like you can input the password. How are we going to turn it on? Interesting. Okay. okay. Well, that seems like the first thing that we need to answer. <coughs> got okay, 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 well. okay, okay, okay. 
let's assume, see, the door is where we came from, right? Right. So let's oh. assume, wait, oh my God. North is Let's that see. way. Okay. North is <laughs> north is behind us. Four. This is the number four, right? No, no, it's not. No, you can't fool me. Looks like a different symbol to me. Like, for instance, a symbol that you often see on maps. Yeah, so, that's what okay. I was going to say. Is this would be north because it's the it's Never you know how you came in. Soggy weedies. Yeah. So that would be three, but, uh, six, seven, five. But again, again, it's spelt like news. So you gotta flip it. Uh, I, I don't understand what you're saying, so I'm gonna try my way first. Okay. Oh, okay. Three, six, seven. Okay. Leave it to me. So wait, wait, wait. Can, right, you, so can you back up before you do this? <laughs> yeah, you see, like I was saying, you gotta write a like news. So yeah, go north, to the go to the right so. where north is. Okay. No, oh, where wait, north is. Where, where north yes. is. <laughs> yeah. So three. Then can you look right? Three. All right. Now go look completely behind. Three, six. Five. Five, seven. seven. Three, six, five, 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 seven. What? Ah! Leave it to what? Me. what the hell? Weird. <coughs> North. Um. Yeah. East. This is east, right? Wait. What? There is a line on top of six. I mean, at this point, I'm grasping at straws. Wait a minute, 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 wait a minute. It's a nine. It's not a six, it's a nine. It's meant to be the symbol that tells you that it's a nine. Fuck you. So that was three, nine, um, five, seven. Three, nine, five, seven. Three, nine, five, seven. Yeah, shush, 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 shush. Three nine five seven 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 this is this is quite clever actually yay, yay! Oh, we got it mm, a digital camera and a USB stick mm -hmm. what's inside of this pornography maybe I can't wait <clears throat> to sneak a peekus. <laughs> Looks like there's no battery inside the digital camera. God, what kind of porn does Monokuma look at? Whoops, the Nature I, Channel? Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I figured that out, game. I'm trying. I keep forgetting that right click is the button. Just less. Just less. less, less. <laughs> Looks like I was able to unlock the lock with USB stick. That's how computers work. Now I need to put in the password next. Maybe the memo that was inside the desk drawer m might be the laptop's password. Smoosh. Oh. I got it! It's the first letters of the day. So that's Monami's idea. Uh-huh. This is the first letter of the day's week. Me <laughs> Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, meaning it's Mitwifus. Oh, that was my mother's huh? name. Huh? It was wrong? I doubt it's that simple. Okay. Can we look at it to try and Wait, so it, it is oh, supposed to be letters? I wonder if there's any other hints. It's like, figure it out, bitch. Look at the puzzle. There... Look at the camera. Uh, oh. Table camera side face. It's not powered by a rechargeable power supply. It looks like it uses a regular battery. But regardless, it won't turn on at all since there's no battery to begin with. So we gotta get a battery. Okay. Is there one in here? Television looks broken. Use uh, pliers on television. <laughs> no, you two, we have a problem. These iron bars are completely blocking the door. As long as we don't do something about these bars, we won't be able to escape from this room. Okay, just checking. Uh, use the pliers on the TV. Is there anything in here? No. Nope. Just, just the cone in here. Okay. Come here, bitch. Okay, never mind. All right, well, fuck me. Come here, uh, bitch. D no, stop! <laughs> Can I use it, uh, maybe oh. scissors to- Fuck! I might fuck. be able to cut my neck! Oh. oh. 
Boop. Doesn't seem to be any buttons for inputting. Slip, but doesn't open. Uh, it's not but it's in the device. And uh, take a picture. Doesn't seem to be any buttons for inputting the lid. Hmm. Oh, sorry. Have you used the pliers the on it yet? No. Okay. Well, let's try a couple things. There aren't any buttons that are important to the lid and the red light. There's no buttons for the lid and there's a red well, light. Well, no buttons for the lid. I'm That's obnoxious. Like, I'm not Ito. Mm -hmm. um, okay. Checked all of in okay. there. Okay. Um, it um, wants us to find another clue, but where? <laughs> oh, can you hit and tab? Why? And get the little like. No. Let me check for. Controlling buttons. Oops. Oh. So I'm gonna do something about the guard. Would you like to take a shortcut and bypass no. the riddles? No. What? Well, what? No. I keep figuring out the riddles, dude. We are MLG. Um, no, I can't find out, uh, or I can't do the. That thing, would make sure. it easy, so yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, what do we have? We can. We have. We have camera that has no battery in it. We got pliers from under there. Oh! Uh, gimme, gimme, gimme! You want me to poo? Poo! Poo! It's a. I got it, got it, got it, got it. Gimme your fucking batteries, bitch. Oh, this plushie. If Sorry, it's talking, it might be powered by a battery. It's not Hajime anymore, bitches! Mm -hmm. Alright, let's try cutting it open! Already. Yeah! I didn't eat any grannies! What a loud thing! Cut it open right away! So ah, there was something! So there was something! Updated the batteries. Is the batteries under the digital Battery camera? Battery camera, eat now them we immediately! Now the digital camera. Okay. We should check the picture that's inside. Oh. This is useless! Oh, fuck off! It's the planets! Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a photo of a space poster that's posted on a wall somewhere. I wonder what it means. What oh, I can't it figure it out. Kill me, Monami! Okay! I have failed. <laughs> Password. Based on the memo in the picture on, in the digital camera, the answer must be something that I didn't memorize. Oh, wait. Um. What the fuck? What's going right on down there? Right ass! I am so confused by the bottom. Well, um, it's I the letters. Look at the M. It stops on random letters? What? And then I need to input them? Wait, what? what are you doing right now? Because it's not obvious. When I click, it puts down a thing. And when I hit stuff on the keyboard, oh. Okay. So, that is. The reason this is down here is for the controller. But, um. Can I. Can I escape from this hell? Because I need to look at the thing again. Well, I guess I just need to input a wrong password. So, now. oh, are you typing on your computer right now? Yeah, yeah, but I can. Use the controller. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Okay. Because I was gonna say you can leave by just going to okay. Mm -hmm. Hey Nagito, you you stink. <laughs> okay. So uh, S M V E M J S. I'm just gonna write this down. I, I was about to, but yeah, you go for it. M V E M J S. You can do it, Ammer. Oh, you solved that puzzle, man. Oh, you got fucking donuts, dog? No, this time it's nuts. Mm. Oh, damn. It's okay. like I said when you lost to Hangman's Gambit. You're the ultimate gamer. Mm-hmm, thank you. Just mm -hmm. remember in the in the back of your mind that we need to play another Hangman's Gambit after we've done this. Woo! Yay! <laughs> okay. Is this Othello? Hmm. Oh, you know. Othello, a thing that every foreigner would know? Yeah. <laughs> is this, is this Othello? Othello? What the okay. fuck is Othello? Well, that relates 
What the fuck is a pillow? <laughs>